Like, hey, we'll need some help solving this creepy mystery. Like, how about typing in your name before we start? Like, groovy, hip, out of sight, right on, man. Way out. Let's get moving. Spooky. Spookier. Spooky. Los Burritos. Well, gang, we found a town. Maybe we can stop for a snack. Yeah, Rex. Like, what a dump. Uh, I'm not sure there's going to be a hot dog stand around here, guys. According to this map, Los Burritos is a ghost town. Ghost? <laughs> <laughs> not real ghosts, guys. Velma just means the town is deserted. Like, we knew that. We were just... Oh, Velma. Like, what sort of sound would a ghost make if it did live in this town? Good question, Shaggy. Let's find out where that moaning is coming from. We've got to find out where that moaning is coming from. Which way should we go? Run, run, broken. <laughs> All right! Way to go, Scoob! Nice work! Right? <laughs> Like, forget it! I'm not going over there! Let's keep exploring. We're sure to find something. Like, the moaning is really getting louder! That means we're on the... Yikes! Looks like we found out where the moaning's coming from! Come on, let's try and help it! Like, hey, it looks like one of those old player pianos. I wonder if it works. I'm going to take off his gag. There you go. Thank you. Now find the keys to unlock me. They're somewhere in this room. A key. Hey, Scoob! Want to ride the mechanical bull? Yeah, yeah. Great. Hey, give me a nickel. Jeepers! A key. It's one of the keys. Thank goodness you've come. Those chains were beginning to chafe. And who are you delightful young people? I'm Fred. And this is Daphne, Velma, Shaggy, and Scooby-Doo. Scooby-Doo! I'm Artifact, professor of archaeology. My students and I have been excavating this old ghost town. I was working here in the saloon when someone grabbed me from behind and tied me up. It's a good thing we came along. Where are your students? Most of them have been chased away by the Faceless Rider. The Faceless Rider? Zoinks! You see, Los Burritos used to be a famous outlaw town. Everyone from James Jester to the El Cito Bandito used to make a home here. Now my students are convinced that their ghosts are haunting this town. I don't blame them for feeling that way. The Faceless Rider is quite a spectacle as he sits atop his horse, cloak blowing in the wind. Jinkies, that sounds just like the rider we saw coming into town. Like I told you it was a ghost. Ghost or not, we're getting to the bottom of this. Say now, here's an interesting thing I dug up. What do you make of it? Thanks, that could come in handy. We'll take it along. Suspects include... It's a feather. That's Professor Artifact. 
He knows all about digging stuff up. Pies! Delicious pies! Yummy! <laughs> like pie in the sky! Look out! Uh-oh. It looks like there's gonna be a pie fight. Jinkies! Showdown at Pie Noon! Like, look out, Scoob! Use your mouse to move Scooby left and right. Then click on your mouse button to throw. See what's upstairs. Let's split up. You guys stay here. We'll be right back. Okay. Why would a ghost be haunting this old town? This was a big hideout for old time. Let's check out the view. It's the faceless rider. He's digging out there. We've got to find a way out to the found a nickel. It's the faceless rider. He's digging out there. Fred, why don't you and Daphne stay here? The boys and I'll check out this one. Like we're not going in there. It looks dark and creepy. Oh, for good. Let's keep going. We're running out of time. Zoinks! Like what's that pounding? It's coming from under the stage. Thanks, folks. I'm glad you heard me knocking. What were you doing under the stage? I was digging under the stage when this ghostly figure in a cloak locked me in. I'm Jenny Lariat, by the way. I'm doing research on hauntings in the Old West. Note, faceless rider spotted in saloon. Like, what a coincidence. We're running from a ghost, too. I think the faceless rider may be the ghost of one of the old brick-in-the-wall gang. The town of Los Burritos has quite a history of outlaw activity. This place used to be crawling with cutthroats and thieves. No, oh, rot cutthroats! The most notorious outlaws were the Brick in the Wall Gang. They were famous for fast riding and daring robberies. About 150 years ago, they robbed a huge shipment of gold from the El Seiko Treasury. Rumor has it they buried the gold somewhere in this town. Like maybe the ghost doesn't want anybody to find the gold. I don't know. It sounds suspicious to me. I've been finding strange things all over town. Take a look at this. Suspects include... It's a boot spur. Somebody must be walking around with only one. It's a feather. And if I'm not mistaken, it comes from a hawk.
There you go, Scoob. Give that bull the ride of its life. Where'd it go, Scoob? Scooby-Doo! Let's keep going. Now that we have the handle, we can make the pump work. Let's give it a try. Keep pumping. Why? I think there's something. All right. Something came out. It's a key. Afternoon, folks. What brings you to Los Burritos? We're just passing through, Sheriff. Are you the local law? I'm Chuck D. Wagon, the Sheriff of El Seco. El Seco? The county seat, just down the highway from here. You must be here to capture the faceless rider. Leave it to the professionals. That's my motto. We're crime solvers, too. We call ourselves Mystery Inc. Well, if you're crime solvers, then you must be pretty observant. You betcha! In fact, we haven't seen a single hot dog stand. What I mean is, you must have observed some facts about the town. I've got questions for you. Answer them, and I'll tell you what I know. How much does root beer cost in the saloon? A dollar fifty? Twenty-five cents? Five cents? One million dollars. Yes, indeed. How many patches are on Gummy Bear's pants? Four, eight, sixteen, two. Try again. You'll get Retro! It's the railroad station. Like, wake up, old prospector dude! How do we wake him up? Listen, he's snoring a melody. I know. Let's try playing the same melody he's snoring. Like I don't see a piano. Use the bells on the donkey. If we play the bells in the right order, I'm sure he'll wake up. He sure does snore loud. <laughs> You're one to talk. Howdy, kids. Have you got my teeth? Rainbows. Okay, gang. Let's pry the clock loose and take it. How many patches are on Gummy Bear's pants? Four, eight, sixteen, two. You know your stuff. Please bring me something that tells the population of the town. Here you go, sir. Yes, indeed. This is what I've been waiting for. Here's something you might find interesting. I found it on the ground the last time I saw the faceless rider. That could come in handy. We'll take it along. Suspects include... Soap! 
A fresh bar of it. Looks like somebody's trying to keep a clean nose. Like if you're done checking out all the suspects. Like we've had enough excitement for one day. All right, you three stay here and we'll check it out. Did you notice these bricks? Yeah, some of them are a strange color. Let's split up. Right. Rhyme, run with. Rummy. Perhaps something else. Put it in and set it to 9 o'clock. It worked! The vault is opening! The key has to fit one of these boxes. It's a set of false teeth! Gross! I'm sure we can find a home for these. I did. Have you got my date? I need. Here you go, sir. Thanks for the teeth. I hit them so as the bandits couldn't steal my gold tooth. Oh, I got something for you, young whippersnappers. Thanks. That could come in handy. We'll take it along. Suspects include. It's a top secret map. It shows how to get to Boot Hill from the tunnel. Like, where are we now? At my dig site. Interrupting my work with your untidy presence. How am I supposed to get any work done if you keep bothering me? Who are you? Irving C. Double. And who might this messy pair be? Rost. We're lost! And we're Shaggy and Scooby-Doo! I'm trying to fix this artifact I found. I can't see it very well. I must get my eyes checked. Perhaps you can help me. But don't touch me. You're filthy. Click the pieces with your mouse and place them so they form a picture. Here's something of interest. What do you suppose it is? Suspects include... It's a set of handcuffs. I wonder who could have dropped these. Like if you're done checking... Say, what's this? Oh, 
this away! Well rhyme. Well, okay. That was it! That's the combination! Golly, it's a secret passageway! Like a safe with a hole in it isn't very safe! It's a back alley! We must be behind the bank and the general store! That must be where the other door leads! The general store! Like, no way am I going in there! Me neither! I think the boys need some inspiration! Would you do it for us? Let's keep going! We're running out of time!
uh-oh. Yikes! out of time come on scoob let's get into the pokey weepy you can say that again okay weepy <laughs> guys guys where are you i can't see without my glasses what was that like why did you lock us in velma i didn't i lost my glasses zoinks like we're trapped how are we gonna get out i'll be right back i'm going to go for help Let's take this bl- Rider! Like it looks like a tunnel! Boy! Like, where are we now? The roast office. Great. Like, mail me out of this crazy town. an idea. Why don't we use the blanket? It's a lamp? Now that we've got the lantern, let's see. Just as I thought, there's another way out of this tunnel. Let's see where it leads. As well. Come on, gang. Let's roll. Wow. 
Wank, this is super creepy. I prefer to visit graveyards from a distance. Will you come along for some Scooby snacks? Let's keep moving. It'll be dark soon. Huh? Keep searching. We're bound to find something. Suspects include... Of these bricks are shiny. Jinky! Scooby Dooby Doo! <laughs> Keep searching. We're bound to find something. Keep searching. We're bound to find something. Retro! Let's keep going. We're running out of time. Okay, gang. We've got a mystery to solve. I'll wait here while you look around. It's the Faceless Rider. He's digging out there. We've got to find a way out to the graveyard. That grave might have an important clue. Shiny brick. Did you notice these brick? Suspects include... It's a top secret map. It shows how to get to Boot Hill from... It's a set of handcuffs. I wonder who could have dropped these. Keep moving. It's the only way to solve this case. Suspects include... That's Mr. I.C. Double. He's a student.
Let's keep going. We're running out of time. Persistence, that's the name of the game. Let's keep going. We're running out of time. Let's keep going. We're running out of time. I'll wait here while you look around. I'll wait here while you look around. <laughs> well, we could stay here. Or we could keep investigating. Which way we're? It's a wanted poster for. Gang, we made it back together. Scooby-Doo! Like we've had enough excitement for one day. Let's keep at it. We'll solve this mystery. I love my work. I'd love it more if it weren't so messy. I love my work. I'd love it more if it weren't so messy. Suspects include... It's a top... Soap! A fresh bar of it. Looks like somebody's trying to keep a clean nose. It's a boot spur. Somebody must be walking around with only one. Shucks! It's Sheriff Wagon. That's old Mr. Gummy. Gummy Bear, he's lived here forever. That's Professor Artifact, he knows all about digging stuff up. That's Mr. I.C. Double, he's a student. Hello, Jenny, that's Jenny Lariat, she knows all about ghosts. Pick an exit and go, won't you? Pick an exit and go, won't you?
I'm Gummy Bayer. I remember when we used to call shrimp barn ladle. Suspects include... It's a top secret map. It shows how to get to Boot Hill from the tunnel. <laughs> Let's keep going. We're running out of time. Let's keep checking. The ghost was digging out here somewhere. Like, maybe somebody hid cheeseburgers behind... It's another one of those bricks. And it's painted like those... Let's wash the brick. Hey, this must be some of the gold that the Brick and the Wall Gang stole. Like that means the Faceless Rider will come after us for sure. That's what I'm counting on. Nice work, Freddy. We were right behind you all the time, Fred. Yeah, way behind. It's time to declare this mystery solved. Right, Velma. I think it's time we wrapped up this mystery. Like if you're done checking out all the suspects, let's find out who it is. We'll have to choose one. Let's roll. Let's pull back his hood. Time to see a ghost. Huh? It's the sheriff. Like what do you know? We were right. But how could you possibly know? You left little clues all over town. A spur, a hawk feather. Looks like you were doing a lot of quick changes. And don't forget the map. Your county showed you the way to the gold. You wanted the town empty so you could steal it all for yourself. Officer Wyeth, I'm glad you got our call. Glad to help, kids. This must be our gold thief. He sure is. And he's our ghost, too. Ghost who? It turns out the old brick and the wall gang lived up to its name. They hid their gold in the walls of the post office, disguised as ordinary bricks. Our thief here was taking the walls apart to steal the gold and hiding it on Boot Hill. Come on, fella. You've got a lot of explaining to do. It's not fair. I deserve that gold. I found it fair and square. Since when did they make finders keepers a law? You should know better than that. There's enough gold out here to keep me in pancakes for the rest of my life. It would have been paradise. And I would have gotten away with it, too, if it wasn't for you meddling kids. Well, gang, looks like our work here is done. I feel pretty good. <laughs> Me too. How about you, Shaggy? Oh, sure. It's great. We're in the middle of the desert with no gold and no food. I'm hungry. What's that? It sounds like the Faceless Rider. It can't be. It's getting louder. I've heard that sound before. It's Scooby's stomach. Like, he's hungry. <laughs> I hear there's a great pancake house in El Seco. Let's roll. <laughs> Scooby-Doo. See you soon.